okay guys welcome you all uh, in this video we will talk about some other google docs that how we can create google doc for us first of all type in url colon then come and dot we can say that search.php we can say that uh, php id is equal to 1 if we press enter there are different sites search tool any country any time reading level or we can say verbatim right click and here <coughs> if we put single quotation mark it will show us a result that means it's not vulnerable to sql injection now here single quotation mark it is also not vulnerable you have to check this like this if someone find an error it mean it is vulnerable to sql injection this is vulnerable to sql injection here is an error <coughs> okay now if you put one if we want to put two it will also show us a result of id is equal to two like this if we put here three or four five it's on you nine press enter it will show us a <coughs> sites that are id is equal to nine here you can check that php question mark id is equal to 9 it's on you that you can customize your search and here is the same process single quotation mark you have an error in your sql injection it's vulnerable yes single quotation mark error well you have seen that maximum sites are vulnerable to sql injection now it's on you that how you can check them and how you can report them it is vulnerable to blind sql injection So this was the process that how you can check here if you want to customize the Google Docs it's on you you can say that any URL code dot us and if you want to add two queries then you can type like this and any url php id is equal to one like this and if you want to target a specific site you can say site edu dot us or dot in dot pk 
it's on you the how you can check so this is the method that how you can check so thank you for watching this video we'll meet you in the next video this was all about sql injection thank you